what, almost 20 years. Almost 20 years. years. One of the main reasons I'm here in Japan so long too. And I'm very proud of she has become. <laughs> <laughs> Someone who knows what she's about, but also I think not impression. Maybe she's like poverty. I just want to encourage you to keep it up. The moment I messaged her and she replied to me, she's been pulling me towards her. I, I love you. Love you. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Danny, and in this video today, I'll be showing you snippets and highlights from my birthday in Tokyo. It's uh, the Thursday before the Olympic Friday, so we're going to hang out in Shinokubo. Technically, this is not what I wanted to do for my birthday, but this is kind of like the backup plan and we're just rolling with it. I'm gonna hang with my friends, people that I really love and care about, and I'm gonna take you guys along with me as a whole a weekend of celebration for me so this is not the only thing that i'm going to do um but please like please share please hit that subscribe button down below and just come 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 with me while i show you my birthday 2021 i'm excited all right guys stick around Mwah. Almost 20 years. Wow. <laughs> yes. I love you curry chicken and rice. And I should love curry chicken. And I wish you many, many more happy birthdays. Thank you. I love you too. Thank you. <laughs> how, how can you, how can you go with 20 years? Like, you're like to me next. Like, so. <laughs> So Who's next? Daniel, I'll go next. It's been five, five years. Yes. Okay. And uh, you've been uh, like one of those, like the main, one of the main reasons I'm here in Japan so long too. Really? I'm gonna stay with you and Patina because, like, if I didn't have both of you in my life, mm -hmm. like everything here would be just like different, It'd be, like dull. And I. I'm grateful for you. Yeah, I'm grateful, I'm grateful for you for too. Always checking in. Um, always like always talking, always sharing something. And uh, you know, I don't like giving speech, but <laughs> you're very important to me. You are too. Thank you, darling. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Mackie. Don't post those anywhere. Fifteen years, and we haven't seen each other much 
Yes. Over those years, but the friendship has remained strong. I can always talk to her. When we do talk, we talk, you know. And I just love her energy, her aura. Like, good energy. I love talking to her, I love being around her. Um, and I'm very proud of she has become and become me. I'm very, very proud of you. Thank you, darling. Thank you, darling. Mwah, mwah, mwah. I love you too. <laughs> Anybody else? No? <laughs> okay. <hours>. Yes. Yes, I hope so too. I hope so. Through Carrie, we shall. Yes, Carrie? Yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, aside from Katie, I think I've known um, Danny at least a number of years. Yes. Not even a year yet. Not even a year yet, yeah. I always saw her videos. I always saw her acting on the Black Women in Japan. And you know, it's really good not to form a comment on people. She always came across as like um, someone who knows what she's about. But also, I think it got the impression that maybe she's like poverty, you know? <laughs> she was always like, speak is for me. I always thought it was about her, someone who, she's confident, you know? But when I met her, I'm like, this girl is so chill. She's my kind of people. We met the first time, it was like, I've known her for years. Yeah, that's true. She's really awesome. And uh, I'm just looking forward to years of friendship so I can say five years <laughs> 20 years <laughs> oh yeah she's really really good you know even like sometimes I'm having a down day or you know even when I um, I had a recent change in my life you know she's always somebody you can talk to and she's not judgmental and she's just calming and she reassures you really positive you know and it's really so good that I'm meeting you guys for the first time too but we just get along well, so it really mm. shows that she, she, she's someone who pulls in the right energy. Yes. That's so important now. It is. So I love you, Tani. I love you too, darling. Thank you so much for that beautiful speech. Yeah. <laughs> I just want to say that uh, I've known Danny for a while, you know. <laughs> I, I knew her through uh, wife. <laughs> <laughs> the time I knew her, I realized that she has a good energy and I, I, I enjoy it. Um, I just want to encourage you to keep it up. Thank you. Yeah. Alright, thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs> thank you, Kenzie. Yeah, I appreciate it. Thank you. She knows what she wants. Keep it up. No. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Alright, Mr. Wayne. You wanna say something? Okay. <laughs> Alright, hello everyone. So I won't say how long I've known her but because for me time doesn't really matter when it comes to the fight. So when I met her, like when I finally got the chance to meet her, she's she's been a beacon to social media. Like, at the moment I messaged her and she replied to me, she's been pulling me towards her. And just by meeting you all, like the energy I'm getting from everyone here, it's been like great energy, positive energy thus far. So yeah, for me, like, I didn't form any opinions about Daniel, like, the, like before meeting her. But the moment I met her, I'm like, wow, <laughs> this wasn't meant to happen. Because, like, like for me, I consider myself, you know, like I think my energy is positive, and like I, I was just drawn to her. Mm, like, it is. Moment, you know? so I was like, you know, this was destined to happen, and it's been valuable thus far. I've known. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, I won't say how long I've known her for, but yeah, man, so far it's just been positive energy and abundance with her. So, Daniel, thank you for that. All right, thank so, you very much as well. <laughs> Thank you so much, guys. Okay, so what do I say? I'm gonna just bundle everything in one because there is like a lot of you guys here. Yeah. I just wanna say I appreciate everyone who 
for coming here and just like Mickey just said, um, you guys are the reason why I've been in the fan support system. And then to have all of you guys added to it recently, it's just, um, you know, made it much more, um, what, what should I say? more fulfilling for me to be here and um, I look forward to getting to know Haley more and Kingsman more through Casey and Gavin more as well and you Perry also <laughs> <laughs> I love you all. You all are precious. Very, very important people in my life. I don't usually let people get close to me. So the fact that I allow you guys to come close to me, that really means that you're special and you're with people because I, I really suck out people and see, you know, yeah, what you have about you. So thank you so much, everyone, for coming and thank you again for being in my life. I love you all. Can we get to like a group hug or something? So that was a lovely birthday dinner, wasn't it guys? Let me know your thoughts down in the comments section. So what you're currently looking at now is me heading down to um, Odaiba for the weekend just to relax. You're looking at the Rainbow Bridge right now. This is a very famous bridge in uh, that part of Japan. And actually the hotel that I stayed at, it was about uh, 30 minutes ish or maybe less from the Olympic Village and I really wanted to go down and um, check out the Olympic Village uh, where the athletes are staying at but COVID so <laughs> yeah this is me walking up um, into the hotel right now going through the lobby actually this the building that the hotel is in the hotel is just four floors so I'm, i'll be going all the way up to the 36th floor uh that's where the hotel lobby is so i have to catch this, these elevators now at the bottom uh that you'll see coming up pretty soon in this clip and um i actually stayed on the 35th floor and that view was absolutely gorgeous you guys will get to see it in a second just stay stay tuned throughout you know the rest of this video and you know just it's just breathtaking like i could look at that forever let me let me know what you think about it in the comment section down below guys I also want to say that I really enjoyed staying at this hotel. The staff, they were very nice. I didn't feel like, I think I was the only black person there and I really didn't feel as if, um, you know, I was being stared at or singled out or whatever the case may be. I felt um, just like a normal person. And that's very, very important for me whenever I travel anywhere in Japan because, you know, th there is the, what's the word I'm looking for? The tendency for you to be othered or singled out because you're the foreigner in, you know, such certain situations. So I'm very happy that the staff were nice. Hi guys. So this is the second half of my birthday vlog. I'm currently in Odaiba and I am excited. I'm looking at this lovely view that I showed you guys earlier. I'm at the, uh, what's the name? Mitsui Garden Hotel in Odaiba. And uh, it's just relaxation for the weekend. And chill and enjoy my birthday. I'm extremely grateful. I'm happy and feeling very blessed and thank you guys for coming along the ride with me if i'm not looking in the camera it's because the sun is like directly in my eye so i apologize um to you guys so check out the rest of the video i'm going to give you a tour of the 
uh, hotel briefly and the area if I can I'm trying to not go outside as much as possible because COVID but I'll um, share with you as much as I can all right so stay tuned and enjoy the rest of this vlog oh and subscribe 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 Okay guys, so let me show you around the room a little bit. So this is just a nice little seating area here. And I can just imagine waking up with this view in the morning with some coffee and reading a nice book or just relaxing. Another seating area over here. And here, um, don't mind my fan. It's just a mirror that's in the drawer here fancy hey and uh, the hotel rules and all of that so as you guys can see it's a garden hotel nice comfortable bed and here we have TV and the mini bar is under here and kettles cups and all that zhuzh over here we have a closet and of course the um what do you call it safety box oh, is this a lantern i guess so for emergency purposes and that's it for the closet guys tell me that this view isn't just breathtaking like comment down below and let me know what you think i'm going into the bathroom area right now and uh, you can see the sink area the mirror and actually uh the blinds i'll be opening the blinds in a second there we go and um i eventually raised these blinds so that you know i could just look out through the window at the view while i you know do my morning routine my nighttime routine as well and here is the shower area you know the, it had the rain shower and the bath was just big and gorgeous and um this is like half the size of my bath in my bathroom you know there's the, that view again it was just so nice taking a shower and looking outside those windows oh my god temperature check up okay 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 Okay. Come on. Ah, okay. <laughs> Super fun. Come on, ragazzo. Oh, okay. No more. Mojito? Yes, yes, yes. Okay, all right, guys. Come on. Yes, sir. Hmm? Oh, all right, guys. Come on. How's your friend's phone?
Look at the view. It's 7 p.m. at night. And this is just fantastic. Ooh. And it's beautiful. Tokyo skyline. Show you guys down there what it looks like. Ooh, pretty, ain't it? say that right now you guys watch watch um meet the mitchell i almost wanted to go and sing tammy's song you know that she sings to the baby little oz <laughs> that's the song that's in my head right now but anyways good morning guys it is saturday and uh, i stayed up last night to watch the opening ceremony of the olympics i was hoping to see some fireworks from where i am but there was no fireworks outside. Nonetheless, I'm dressed in my Jamaican gear. It says Wagwan. And I'm about to have some breakfast now. My plan for the rest of the day is <clears throat> maybe I want to go to the onsen. I'm not sure because of COVID. So I'm in my mind. Maybe I just use the, the bath with a view in the hotel room since that was the whole reason for coming. You know what I mean? just to enjoy and relax and then I'm gonna try to walk around um, there's a nice let me show you there's a nice oh the view for this morning so there's a nice path or walkway let me see if I can show you guys da, 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 da. come on zoom 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 Okay, so you can see the pathway right there. So I'm gonna try and go down there for a walk. Get some exercise in after breakfast. So this is what outside looks like. It's cloudy day today, actually. Oh, I can see Tokyo Sky Tree. Can you guys see it? It's Tokyo Sky Tree. Right there. Zoom. Tokyo Sky Tree. Alright, guys. So, talk to you in a bit. Alright, so I just finished eating breakfast and I headed down from the hotel through this nice, uh, lovely park. I stopped to take some photos. And then I saw the train coming by. Train! I love to see the train on the tracks here in Japan. It's just, um, you know, I don't know. I get this euphoric feeling. Train going by all the time. And so after that passed, then I went down to the, um, what do you call this? Boardwalk, I think. Finally made it down to the dock. But it's hot as hell. I'm not going to stay long out here though. But it is beautiful. So, 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 so beautiful. And the sun is coming out. Yay. Yay. This mask and this heat, this ain't it at all. This ain't it. the hotel train I'm gonna have myself a lovely bath right now relax
Here I am now walking in the streets of Odaiba. I'm trying to find a restaurant that I booked. Uh, I made reservations for my birthday lunch, quote unquote birthday lunch. And it was a bit difficult to find because Google Maps was messing around. But eventually I did. And this is just a picture of inside. It's supposed to be a German restaurant, but I'm not sure that the food that I got was German food or I was in probably was just not adventurous enough. I had a mojito uh, or two and they weren't serving alcohol so it was just like a virgin mojito and I got some roast pork, some roast chicken and a salad and some rice. Uh, it wasn't the best food. I actually would not recommend this spot um but i wanted to try something other than what i had been eating at the hotel and just get out of the hotel for a bit so that's what i did okay guys so let me open up some of what i got for my birthday so you guys can see some of my gifts purple is my favorite color so of course my friend my best friend knew how to wrap you know, my gift in purple. How sweet. And again, again, another card. More card. You know what people put in cards? Guess what? People put in cards. Money out. Okay, there's this cute little, cute little gift wrap box so let's see what is inside here let's see what is inside here I think some kind of jewelry oh it's from Zara let us see let us see what is inside here I bet it's cute. Aww. It's a nice necklace that says D. Can y'all see? Okay. Let me try it on. Kawaii. I love this. It's cute. Kawaii. Ne. Cute. It's cute, right? Cute. My my nails are getting in the way. Let me just put it on. Put on my neck. So you guys can see. Come on camera, work with me. See it? It's nice. Isn't it? Okay. Thank you, Patina. Card for me. No, Sherry, what's on my cards for you guys? Birthday wishes to you. <laughs> this is funny. Happy birthday, Dove. At least you're not as old as you will be next year. <laughs> this is a good one. Oh, no, you'll check my grammar. No, I'm not the grammar police anymore because I make my fair share of mistakes. <laughs> okay, this one is from Mackie. Kawaii. Cards are so cute. I'll show you Patina's cards. Kawaii. 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 Guess what's in this? Money oh I'm not tell how much money we get. How money in there? Money, money, money. Let me read Makisha's card. Because that's what I want for my birthday. Because the things that I want for my birthday ain't cheap. I pray this birthday will be ever more special than the ones before. I pray that you will get your heart's desire i am grateful to have you as a friend and i hope i get to celebrate more special moments with you 
Please buy yourself something nice. Love, Mackie. Ah, so cute. Thank you, Mackie. I appreciate it. This one's from Carrie. Carrie didn't have time to give me any note, but thank you very much, Carrie. I appreciate it. And again, from Patina. This is so cute. I don't even want to. I don't even want to touch it. Can I just wait to touch it? I want to savor. <laughs> savor the moment. Wait, let me, let me just open it. God damn it. I already know what's inside. These are cute. Where do you find those patina? This is like 100 yen stuff. That's cute. Money. Right. Money, money, money. Okay. Thank you, Patina. And this is from my other friend, Gavin. This is a white chocolate vanilla cream. I don't know what this tastes like. Let me try it out now. Plastic hotel cup with some ice. Maybe I should shake it. Shake, 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 shake. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Wait, there's water inside. Let me drink it. Live chocolate vanilla cream. 15% alcohol. Oh, yeah. My friends know me well. You know me well. See, Bailey's Irish cream is my favorite. So, this is nice. Mmm. -hmm. I can actually mix this with the Bailey's. Have a buzz. Alright, guys. So, those are just a few of my gifts. I have others to open and more on the way but these are what I could manage to bring with me because they're light at the hotel so I hope you enjoyed me sharing them with you okay guys so I think that's gonna be it for me for my birthday vlog I really hope you guys enjoyed it uh, it was difficult to film in some instances because oh my god outside is so hot it's like oh. The moment I go outside, I just want to come back inside. So I didn't even get to capture half the things I wanted to capture because the heat is unbearable. So I hope you guys appreciate this that you got and comment down below. Let me know what you think about it. Please like, please share, please subscribe and share. And don't just come and lurk on my channel and not leave a comment or share it with your friends and family all right guys please watch those ads watch those ads on my videos thank you so much for tuning in and i'll see you in my next video bye bye so i wanted to give you guys some information about odaiba where i went and odaiba is actually a man-made island it's a popular shopping and entertainment district and originally um, it was a smaller or there were smaller sets of islands and daiba literally means fort and they were built at the end of the Edo period between 1604 to 1868 to protect Tokyo against attacks from the sea. And as time went by, they joined those smaller islands into a big uh, island, you know, by filling up the land. So it's like a massive landfill. And um, they had development projects and uh odaiba just eventually turned into this um kind of like posh extravagant area you know during the economic bubble in japan so um a lot of uh, tv stations or channels are located down there and uh shopping malls uh you know 
to it's a it's a lavish tourist spot um basically so i would recommend uh visiting odaiba it's actually very cool and um, i'm sorry i didn't get to show you a lot of what the island um, is about but rest assured if i get the opportunity i'll definitely go back in the future to share more with you guys so thank you for watching my video please like please share and click that subscribe button if this is your first time and if you have subscribed check to make sure that you're still subscribed to my channel all right guys i love you for watching bye bye